Man, you know what? I swear in the worst. With his mat bands. I swear in the worst. Mark, uh, yeah. dominating performance. Uh, talk us through from start to finish. Obviously, you was taking out the car. Uh, there seemed to be, uh, uh, you know, a lot of bruising there. Yeah. Is that something that you thought would be effective in this? Yeah. Well, we watched. I watched his previous fights, and uh, it does a lot of dangerous stuff, spinning, which I like to do as well. And I knew he likes to move a lot, so I didn't want to work a lot, like getting moving and stuff. So I thought I'll start early with the calf, you know, get that going, and then I can be safe and work work from there. And you were training out in the, the Netherlands as well? In the Netherlands, yeah. Uh, how did that impact your performance, and what did you learn from there? Like, at that gym, you know, people smash you. It's not like an easy round. So every time, because kickboxers are not used to calf kicks, it just made me better because they do low, low, low kicks and they were hurting me every time. So every time they gain the best of me, I just go to the calf. So I think that made me better by just spying on these guys. Tough as hell. And he was someone that you wanted. You obviously uh, yeah. said that before. Uh, was it everything that you expected it to be in terms of like the style matchup? Yeah, the style matchup. Yeah, I know he's, you know, he's a strong fight, he's explosive, and I knew he'd bring out the best to me. Just training wise, I knew, you know. Like I said, you know, you're vulnerable at any, any time, any time anybody can get beat. Now I respect that, so I knew coming to this fight, I had to be really prepared. Mark, do you uh, really like any, any other fights on the card today? Uh, today, I've not really watched any right now. You know, so we'll, we'll see, I'm seeing fights, but you know, I'm taking time and uh, just see how it goes, because I'm, I'm not trying to rush no more, you know, because when you start losing, people start to laugh at you. I'm not into that, you know, regroup. Give him a team and see what's next. You say that you thought that Flanda would bring out the best in you, but this really was a, a near flawless performance. Were you yeah. almost surprised at how well everything just clicked and landed for you? It's just a matter, you know, sorry, it's just a matter of like the people I've got around, around me right now. It's not just me fighting. I've, I feel like I have other brains working, which before I was losing. I was like, it's just myself, you know, I'm just going in being crazy, but I don't really know. But people were, get, people were beating me by margins, you know, like mm. just a game plan, simple game plan will beat me. So. I've took that on board. I'm like, I need a team that have brain and I can implement the game when I'm fighting, which I'm doing now. Mark, is there any fight from the three losses you would like to take the revenge? Definitely Nasrat. Nasrat, just because that was a different fight, you know. And uh, nothing personal. I just know what I'm capable of, you know. And uh, my mindset wasn't really right. I just saw it. Uh, I went autopilot mode. And I'm not saying to be a bear or anything. I just think. I'm a better fighter, you know, it's not over yet. I'm gonna come back and you know give my give my revenge. Is there any chance to see you in American top team in the future? What? In American top team in the future uh, for your training camps. Probably, you know, it's a great team. I'll probably go for my wrestling and stuff. But I just think right now it's about, you know, just keep improving, you know, keep improving my team that I have now. But if I need to go for wrestling I will go. But I believe I've got the best team right now to move forward and getting better. Is there any part of the world you would like to compete in in the next fight? I've been everywhere. <laughs> I've been everywhere. Like, there's a show, I'm sure February, January, sometime in England. I like to be on that card. Right now, I just want to go home and re this has been a long camp for me. I just want to perform at my best and uh, I'm going to take some time off and see what's next. Is there anyone that interests you? Obviously, you said you'd like to get yeah. Nazra, you know, get that win back, but is there anyone looking forward that you would, uh, you'd like to go up against next? Uh, no, at the moment, I'm not going and thinking. You know, I'm not just talking like, I don't know, I want to go home and think. What's next? Who's there? Who's what? And uh, move and get it match up. So what's next? Like what was the next side of tonight's night after your cheesecake? I yeah. <laughs> I've been posting a lot of cheesecake pictures, <laughs> so we're gonna go for cheesecake. And yeah. there's cheese toast, like. No, just cheesecake. I just love cheesecake. Yeah, enjoy it. Yeah, exactly. thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. All right. Thank you. <laughs>